Oh, bruh, that's slow switch up. Yeah. Anyways, hello there, we Jungle Beats. Uh, hey. Pleasure to meet you, jolly good show. Uh, fucking the hoe. In the back alley, she loved it for show. My name is uh, Jolly Rogers the, the Row. I'm Alexander Sandalis. Uh, we are back in here. Uh, my name is um, Sand. We're you know. Yep. Um, hold on. Wait. <laughs> don't forget. Don't forget. Don't watch our videos. We're the shit. We're not shit. We're actually quite good, honestly. I think that uh, we've got the potential to be uh, of great interest to a lot of people of our generation here. <laughs> what, you fucking laughing at, you fucking coffer? What'd you call me? Fucking fuck? A coffer. I don't know what the fuck a coffer is, but I fucking called you one. If you want to fucking have a go with me, I'll fucking roll right now, mate. I'll fucking, I'm ready to fucking jam. I'm ready to fucking jam, mate. And I'll fucking punch you one, bro. I'll fucking go. Fucking I. I'll fucking, let's get the track. We're doing a new skull today. Paranoid track. We're doing all the music. It's fucking over the Do it. It's good. Subscribe. <laughs> don't forget. <laughs> How can they after that? Oh. Yeah. Man. <laughs> I think it's all in his mind. Oh. Slow switch up. Yeah. Uh. I like how he like he went from it's all my mind to paranoid. Saw the devils in his dream. He made him bleed. I love that line. In the end, it's only a dream. I love that. Mm. That that it's such a, a a descriptive kind of like I can picture that. We all have like dreams and nightmares of like, you know, facing our version of the devil. What up, McNeil? Mm. Bruh, thank you for the lyrics to put up again, man, because we'd, we'd be lost without it. <laughs> Most definitely. Um, oh, man. I want, I want to know where that comes from for him. If you guys got any uh, understanding of like his persona and, and what type of pain or suffering or, mm. or joy and happiness this comes from. I don't know, like, how does someone craft this type of music? Like where does that come from for him? Um, that's true. I'd love to know. Shit, that's a good question. I feel like with pretty much every genre, like no matter what emotion you're feeling, you can convey it. But I feel like also with every genre, there's a certain emotion which is taken above all others. Yeah, once again, quite a different track compared to the ones we've heard in terms of production. Like it was a bit more slower. With a bit like, no, no. Wasn't like, wasn't fucking, fucking cover. Sorry. Yeah, he, how he slowed it down. And oh, just when he it. slowed down the end, like I was just yeah. like, I got a bit of tingles over my body, man. I was just like, oh. It's like it was melting around you. Oh, it was. Like everything was just like, like shape-shifting. Yeah, like a Van Gogh painting, something like that. It's kind of like your mind, like, because you felt like it's all my mind, like everything like was in his mind. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Crack the fucking man, Da Vinci Code right there. I'm like, <laughs> from every track we've done by him, there's been similarities, but also a lot of differences with yeah. every track, which is what makes this artist so unique and special. I am not bored. I'm constantly wanting more. I constantly want to see what next track, what little other similarities and other different things I'm going to catch and pick up. This shit's fucking dope. I fucking love it. I want to fucking go right now. I want to fucking quick. slap this Get out of here, man. Slap He's not crazy, man. Fucking Best guy out of here, quick. Oh, I want you to fuck He's me, about to fucking Lord. eat everybody. Lord, fuck Make me. sure to subscribe. Fuck me, Scarlord. Because if you don't, do me fucking like we're going to die. Did. Daddy did me. Oh, right, mate. You can be my daddy, Scarlord. You can be my daddy, bro.